Hallo, Trudy. Gretchen? Ja. Oh, Gretchen, 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 Gretchen. Oh, poor dear, you have changed so. You haven't. Oh, darling. <laughs> oh, Gretchen, I am so happy. You know, I never believed we would see each other again. Uh, I was counting on it. <laughs> I mean, uh, I was counting on the days until this moment. So, Trudy, um, how is Carl? Oh, fine. Yeah, well, it's too bad he couldn't make the trip with you. Oh, yeah, he is miserable when we're apart. Oh, Gretchen, what a wonderful man Carl is. And what a wonderful life he has given me. Oh, the love, the respect, the jewelry. <laughs> Mrs. Gatley, your tea. Ah, oh, Marcy, thank you. Oh, oh. Here we are. You know, Gretchen, I, I was a little worried there for a moment. On the way over here, the cab driver said that there was no Mrs. Gatling. Well, uh, perhaps he was new in town. Well, that's what I thought. But he told me that he has been living here for 30 years. Mrs. Gatling, forgive me for interrupting. That's OK. But you promised the governor you'd meet him at that party. Well, that was my line. <laughs> This cab driver said that he had known the previous Mrs. Gatling, but he had never heard of Gretchen Gatling. Why do you suppose that is, Gretchen? I, I don't know. Well, there must be a reasonable explanation. Oh, I'm sure there is, and I would just love to hear it. Well, um... Uh, listen, I think I hear the governor now, in the hallway. <laughs> Gretchen, my love, I'm home. <laughs> I've missed you so. <laughs> oh, forgive me. You must be my Gretchen's dear friend, Trudy. <clears throat> Jean Gatling, governor of this great state. Gretchen, you never wrote to me that your husband was a sh... A, 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 a... <laughs> Gretchen, you never told me that Trudy had a speech impediment. <laughs> but she did tell me you play the glockenspiel. Yeah, yeah, I do. Heard you're not very good. How was the cocktail party, Governor? Oh, it was a dreadful bore. It always is, without my darling at my side. When I found out she was going to be late, I came over here to whisk her off myself. At a moment too soon. 